love Angie. She is an amazing person to work with. Anytime I have some crazy idea or I need help with a project, I know that when I call Angie, it's not going to be a let me think about it. It will be an enthusiastic yes. When the Leadership Institute began two years ago, there were a lot of logistics to work out. And one of them was the incorporation of our equine program into the curriculum. And so we worked with Christine Wilkie to do the actual programming. But the logistics part of it, Angie was such a huge help to me. She actually led us into the classroom and she rearranged the classroom so that we could have dinner in there. She was so gracious to our community leaders and gave them tours of the barn. She even stayed during the session and participated. And I will be forever grateful for that. Logan um, has strong family ties to St. Mary of the Woods College. Uh, his family opened their doors to St. Mother Theodore Guerin. He's really one of the first students I thought of when the co-ed decision came and one person that I was really excited uh, that would get to come to St. Mary of the Woods and experience and kind of uh, thrive here. Um, he is a quiet leader. He's someone that's always involved in campus activities. Um, he's already jumped headfirst into several activities. He's involved in anything you want to look at, anything you can do in campus. He's manager on the soccer team. He's a student ambassador. He just really is involved. He's, the, he's really the type of student that thrives here at St. Mary of the Woods College. Really happy to have him and uh, really lucky that he's part of our college campus. Well, Marsha, she really embodies what it means to be of the woods. She created a program for nursing built on a philosophy of being called to care. I love the story uh, of a student who was in our first BSN online cohort. She was having a little difficulty being an online student and hadn't been back to school for a long time. Marcia took the time to meet with her in person every week and they worked on academics, but they also worked on technology. And so she helped her work through her homework and those kinds of things that an online student uh, who hasn't been back to class for a long time would have to do. And so Marcia really embodies our faculty and what they're committed to here at St. Mary of the Woods. It is really nice having Matt and the other maintenance and housekeeping staff. Uh, they do so much for the college uh, in regards to, particularly with our department conferences and events, they do so much to get the rooms looking good, and um, which makes it nice when we have guests on our campus. And the work that Matt puts into all of the rooms, all of the venues, he is very particular. He wants everything to look just right. And if there's something that he thinks, if there's a color that's been chosen and he doesn't think that it's right, he will say, how about we try this? I think this would look better. And he's got a great eye for it. So I think that that is so important. He does his job so well and really puts a nice touch on everything that he does for the college here. Mary is the epitome of all that St. Mary of the Woods College represents. She's driven by her faith, her love of family, and her love of St. Mary of the Woods. As a psychology major with a minor in graphic design, she demonstrates her academic talents and her motivation in class, but she's also very passionate about her faith, and it's really easy to see how she conveys her faith in her art. The faculty relay that Mary very creatively embraces every test that's thrown at her. She loves to be challenged, and she will not stop until she feels that her work is perfect. And that's what we love our Wood students to do, have courage to grow and learn. Mary is a joy to have in class. She's always very positive and smiling, and she's very willing to help her other fellow Wood students. Even one of Mary's faculty uh, commented that um, she feels that Mary has learned quite a bit from her in class, and the professor feels she's learned just as much from Mary. I worked with Tracy a little bit as an undergraduate, and she's really the reason that I went to the internship that I did, and I knew that I wanted to consider the master's program as well. She also has a passion for educating people who are passionate about music therapy. Um, and so she really 
brainstorm and started, sparked this um, MTED program, which really reaches so many students around the country so that these students um, who want to be able to work clinically and want to be board certified music therapists can get all the same education that undergraduates get um, here on campus. They can get it out in California, they can get it out east, they can get it um, all around the country. I owe so much of what I've come to, to know and do really thanks to Tracy and to the, the faculty here. Well, I guess I, I find myself in a really unique situation um, getting to have not one but two students that work for me in the Office of External Relations. You know, Kara and Clea both came to me in really different ways to the office and really um, expressed their interest in me coming more engaged with the community through their service and learning at St. Mary of the Woods. They have taken on this very large initiative this year to co-chair the first ever annual Christmas light parade in downtown Terre Haute in cooperation with the Miracle on 7th Street. We have these young women in our community who are making it one of their life goals this year to pay close attention to the needs of our community. I just look at them and think, wow, Terre Haute, we're lucky to have these two young women here and we're really blessed to have them at St. Mary of the Woods College. Dee Reed is the Executive Director of Marketing and Communications, is an extended cabinet member. She graduated from SMWC, so she has experienced the education here at the Woods firsthand. That's why she has such a passion for the Woods and is so dedicated to uh, the mission of the college. She serves as the advisor of the Black Student Association, and this year at Homecoming, she invited the Black alums back to meet with our current students to get together and have ideas. And Dee is just, she's very passionate, she's fun, she's a great coworker, great supervisor, and she is a true star. Mm -hmm.